one of the trendiest, I guess, more fun things that people can do themselves for getting a new life out of an old shirt is laddering or weaving or braiding. There's lots of fun different names and terms for it, but essentially it's just crocheting. All, all the things that we have laid out in front of us are basically just finger crocheting with the t-shirt itself. Um, there's a lot of really cool, fun, fancy designs that you can do, but when it comes down to it, there are really only two basic things that you need to learn, and you can sort of take it from there. The possibilities are endless. So, we all want to start with a plain t-shirt. We'll do our basic steps on the back. Um, cutting things on the half has always made things a little bit easier. So if you want to take your shirt and fold it in half the other way. Okay, I'll come out fold it in half one way if you want to fold them the other way. Once you've got your anchor and all your little strips cut, you want to stretch them before you start. And I don't know if any of you heard me before. Um, there is nothing that will prevent it from tearing. If you pull too hard, it will tear. You're working with an anchor point. You want to take your first strip that you have there and go underneath the shirt and pull it up and through. That's and how wide your bottom strip is is going to determine how far apart it is your, your pieces are going to stay. Um, if you have an anchor point, these strips are going to come in much closer together, and if you taper this in at the bottom, it's going to come together tighter as well. It's going to, going to cinch things up. Tapering the cuts? Or... Yes. If you taper the cuts towards the bottom, it's going to get smaller at the bottom. And it was tapered in at the distance. On what the size ratio was on the strips that they used, so you can get a feel for what it looks like after it's been stretched out, what it looks like after it's been pulled together. If we can make from 5.30 to 7. So yes, the longer the strips that you cut, the more times that you can go back and do it successfully. Or successively, excuse me. So do you make an anchor point at the bottom? Yeah, you can make that. I do, if you don't want to go all the way, or you can Definitely need the whole 